Good afternoon, everyone. Happy Monday to you all. We're back after a couple weeks off with our chart of the week. And this week, we're going to profile newer technology company Roku. Let's go ahead and mark this chart up as we go along. So what's really impressive here about Roku, check this out on the top pane over here. We have the very, very solid, strong slope of the RSI here, which we like a nice sharp slope moving up with higher highs and higher lows on the indicator. We also have a, a nice series of higher lows in the price chart and a nice channel here with, uh, actually, if we pull that down a little bit over here, and it's about ready to break out of that channel here. On uh, We had some pretty decent volume. So what was really impressive here, let's take a look at this one here, is uh, during these last few days, we have a series of higher lows. We pulled back a little bit after that strong move on Tuesday, pulled back on a little bit lighter volume, and today we moved up sharply higher on a very, very strong turnover today. So that's an impressive move. See that right over there? And uh, with uh, money flow just having gone positive a couple of days ago, we like this action over here in the stock after um, a couple of modest down days, but then today a real super strong up day. So what is this uh, portend about this stock down the road? We have this big, huge gap up here in the low 50s area, which would probably be a bit close to a 20% move to the upside, 20, 25% move to the upside for the stock. Don't expect it to happen in one or two days, but I certainly think that this stock can make its way up towards filling that gap, which would be a nice mover. We had some stock in this, options in this uh, name recently in the Explosive Option Service, booked it today and rolled it to uh, the October, I'm sorry, the uh, August 42 strikes, so we're still in that stock, and we think that we can get up to, uh, into certainly get into this gap over here, area with the, uh, which would be right in here, over the next uh, couple of weeks. So uh, we we think that uh, Roku's got quite a bit of upside left to go here, and uh, even with earnings uh, coming out in July, late July, early August, we still think that uh, Roku's going to deliver and possibly get back up to those old highs in the uh, in the 50s so that's roku thanks for much watching everyone and i'll see you guys next time